lot of people, you know, talk about my relationship with Pac and trying to figure that out, you know, and that was a huge loss in my life. Absolutely, yeah. Because he was one of those people that I expected to be here. And my upset is more anger. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel that he left me. And I know that's not true. And it's right. a very selfish way to think about it. But I really did believe that he was going to be here for the long run. <laughs> Word on the street is that Jada Pinkett is still talking smack about Will Smith. For those of you who don't know or you've been living under a rock, Will Smith and Jada Pinkett apparently have been separated for quite a few years. So with that in mind, let's dive into the video. So apparently there was a letter that resurfaced that got Jada Emotional, which I'm going to put on the screen now. Stop the video and pause it if you didn't get a chance to read the letter. But this is going to lead into my speculation. Now, before I get too deep into it, I want to make a disclaimer. These are my opinions and my viewpoint and mine alone. So don't come for me in the comments. This is just purely speculation. Let's take a deep dive into Jada is not over Tupac. A Willow writing a letter to Tupac. Let's put that on the screen. Jada is not truly over Tupac, and here's why. It's been 20 years since he's been gone why are you still worried about a man getting emotional over letters something that you claim that you and him never had jada is crying like she's a she's the widow of tupac she's crying as if she was married to tupac and they were separated by death and this is the reason why I believe and I speculate that Jada was never over Tupac. Here's another reason why. I feel that Will Smith was the one that she settled for. She settled for Will. She really didn't want Will. If you look at Jada Smith's actions, that does not conclude at all that this is a woman that really wants to be with Will Smith anyway. You are exhibiting behavior that is non-conducive of a happy relationship. And you mean to tell me that you, you mean to tell me that you still, that you do not have feelings for Tupac and yet Willow Smith wrote a letter to him and Willow was not alive when Tupac was even around? The fact that you're still reminiscing over a man that is no longer here lets me know everything I need to know. And Will, you need to leave. You need to stop allowing that woman to emasculate you and degrade you in the public eye. You came to her defense. During this man, Will, came to this woman's defense at the Oscars. And what does he get in return? Slander. Emasculation. You mean to tell me that he comes to your defense at the Oscars and slaps Chris Rock and you're going to go out and tarnish his name even more and emasculate him even more and talk crap about him even more? Every interview that you get on TV, Jada, and you put out is nothing but slander against that man. There is no excuse why Will is under attack like this by Jada. I am outraged as a black man to have to sit back and listen to what Jada is doing to Will. And Will, you need to step up and say enough is enough. 
I'm out. I'm done. That's it for today's video, guys. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, peace.